Walking Street business owners, along with Patia police and city officials, have held a major meeting this week to discuss various problems and solutions on Walking Street. Hi everyone, I am Adam Judd, and this is the Patia News. If you have not already subscribed, liked, and followed, make sure you do so so you can get regular daily news updates. Now for our story. This event actually took place around March 13th, in which, as stated, various city officials, as well as police, and of course, Walking Street bar owners, gathered together to discuss major issues and minor ones, to be fair, taking place on Walking Street in South Patia. Now, one of the biggest issues is the fact that according to bar owners, although the street is closed to traffic every evening from about 7 o'clock p.m. because it is a pedestrian area, a.k.a. Walking Street, there are still too many motorbike taxis flying in and around the area and potentially endangering pedestrians. As a result, city officials stated that they are going to reduce, although not eliminate, the total number of motorbike taxi drivers in and around the Walking Street area and move them nearby. Some other issues that were also brought up were over-aggressive hawkers selling products and services, such as particular shows that we're sure anybody who has ever gone to Walking Street is aware of what we're talking about, and how aggressive they are being towards drawing complaints. City officials promised to look into the matter, although there was not a stern solution brought up for this issue. Also brought up was garbage collection, as well as several other minor issues. Now, one big issue that's been brought up before is whether or not the city will finally remove the signs that stick out over the street and make them flat against the buildings. An area of controversy for some time, as some say that it will ruin the appeal of the street, while others say that it is necessary for fire equipment to get in and around the area. We'll keep you updated on this and all other stories right here at the Patia News.